What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. Today is another exciting day here at the Drop Plus Garage as I will be prepping the engine bay and a few other parts for paint. Um, as you can see, it's already been primed. Uh, today I'm gonna be wet sanding it with a 400 grit uh, followed by a 600 grit and getting it prepped for paint. Um, as you can see, I have a few other components here. Um, I have uh, the strut tower braces, hood hinges, trunk hinges, steering column, uh, hunt up like a butcher shop in here. <laughs> uh, but these are gonna be all uh, utilizing the same color, uh, semi-gloss black. Um, so I'm hoping to knock it out and get them all painted at the same time. With all that being said, guys, let's get started on some wet sanding. guys at this point in the game I have everything uh, wet sanded uh, like I said before I started off with a 400 grit uh, went on to a 600 grit uh, so everything is now complete after that I went ahead and washed everything with a clean sponge and soap and water my next step now is uh, wax and grease removing the entire thing as well as masking off the rest of the car and then we'll get it sprayed
All right, guys, so I have everything masked off and prepped and ready for paint. Um, I'm just gonna do one more final wax and grease remover and then tack cloth it. Uh, but I'm gonna get the paint mixed up for now. What I'm gonna be using now is this Eastwood um, chassis, a uh, 2K ceramic chassis black. Uh, it's gonna dry as a satin finish, which will give us this factory look that we're looking for. And then um, with this being a, um, a ceramic chassis paint, uh, it's also gonna give us increased durability over just a regular paint, uh, which is perfect for the engine bay. I'll get this mixed up and then we'll get to spraying.
right guys, as you can see, uh, everything's painted now, laid down real nice. I got all the hinges painted, um, strut tower brace, a couple of the steering column parts, got the steering column over there. And what this means is front suspension and the engine can now go in. All right guys, so make sure and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss anything on this build. We got a lot of exciting new videos coming up next for you. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure and check us out on Facebook and Instagram at Drop Clutch Garage, and we'll catch you next time.